Hey guys, I'm John with Hops and Brews, and the month of March is actually going to be a very special one here. So we've all heard to lose a pretty decent amount of weight to do a couple things. Work out, diet, and pretty much cut out alcohol. Well, there's been a couple studies saying that you don't really have to cut out your alcohol. And the craft beer industry has been trying to lean toward the people that are trying to stay fit, but still want to indulge in their, well, beer drinking habits. They've been making some fantastic low calorie beers. Get those ones. Anyways, so what I plan on doing for 30 days is basically a moderate morning exercise routine, 20 to 30 minutes for five days a week. Dieting, well, I'm not really going to stick to too heavy of a diet, basically my standard routine that I normally already do, but pretty much be self-conscious of what I'm eating. Obviously, I'm not gonna go for that triple cheeseburger, quadruple cheeseburger, extra bacon, large fry, and supersize everything. No, I'm going to probably go for, okay, look, I should probably have chicken today and some rice and broccoli. That's what I'm gonna go for. And the other thing is I'm going to keep my regular drinking schedule. But what I'm going to do is substitute my heavy bourbon barrel aids, double IPAs, big beers, or whatever I want to drink with low calorie beers or a low calorie cocktail and limit myself to a maximum of two a day. This doesn't mean I'm gonna be drinking two drinks every day. That means I can only drink two of these drinks in one day. So we will see what a moderate workout schedule, somewhat dieting, and still keeping my drinking habits, but at a low calorie area, does. Gotta get ready for all those summer beers I'm gonna be drinking. Mm. Ooh, double IPA. This is good stuff. I'm gonna miss this. And in the meantime, you will see reviews of low-calorie beers for the month of March. So, see you guys later.